What is up, guys? It's gonna be uh, Valhalla, episode 61. And uh, I feel like we're make, making some good progress in this area so far. And uh, we might even be able to, I don't know if we'll be able to get this area done. I don't know how big it is. It doesn't seem overly big, but uh, let's just keep going. I must take my... Wait, this is not the whole of 500 doors. This is not the Rock of the Fallen. Where are the women on the winged horses? Where are the choosers of the slain? My blood enemy! This is Niflheim, the hell of mist and cold. This is where the faithless dead come to die again. This is where ghosts made to mist 
to be forgotten. Your meddling has doomed us all, Crow of Battle. More lies from a liar born. Now speak the truth. What brought the Order to this place? To free a goddess, a creature of power and light, buried by the Jotnar in ages past. A pity, Gorm. You will not meet her now. Bottom's crystal eye. It hums with a strange feeling. Unearthly, what was Gorm digging for? Something deep inside this cave.
No need to hide now, Olaf. Gorm is dead. Gorm? Dead? <laughs> By your hand? He paid a bloody price for broken honor. I will not say more. Return to your sister. Oh, I will. Yet I would first join the villagers at their fire. They tell stories and I like to listen. Though I do not hear. Story time. Telling sagas of their own? Yes, yes. They tell stories. Yes, come, listen. Zokki. Rarundunde. Wasagorori. Neyotzi zizu. Waharu. How? Toyedene. Zinue rodiskara gete. Junk quirotaguani. Dehni zaruki. Totni dagwe. Ya tehni ganare. Ziosumwaya. Danu aquegu. Gasumwa hunzi. Yotzi zizu. Yagoda denegwa. The wagu. Danu rarondo de. Yasunne. Yerde de. Zokki, o sumwagu, ya untke doda, ahyarek, dogatka negre. Tunda ya wasi, rarondo de, ya sagorege. O sumwagu, ya eant da ne, ne yotzi zizu. Zi wa agoyant da haje, wa e na hadu, zi na hoda wa egweni. Nia de gahderege, ya ehoe, zi ya eant da ne, zi de jutsu wagardas. Damn, uh, Avar's uh, sipping for some uh, Indian poon there. You have no idea what the fuck she's talking about. He's still, like, staring at her. There you go, Avar. Different hoes, different area codes. Gods, Rahnaraga, Thagwagara Duhas. I do not understand. Ah, you want me to tell a story? All right, let me think. A story of betrayal, of selfish malice, and of gods who act as spoiled children. Of all our many gods, it is Odin who is the most revered. He is the All Father, the High One, the Wise King. But for all his glories, he can also be the most elusive of his kind. Selfish, solitary, stubborn, even cruel. In days long gone, it came to pass that Odin's son, Balder, died suddenly. Felled by his only weakness, Mistletoe. Believing his son's death an accident, Odin sent a message to the Jotun Hel, asking her to return his beautiful boy to life. Hel agreed, but on one condition. Only if every living creature in the Nine Worlds shed a loving tear for Balder. At once, Odin sent word to every corner of the world, asking all to weep for his beloved boy. And all did. But one. A Jotun named Thok refused to cry for Balder. Let Hel keep what she has received, Thok said, with malice. And that was that. Balder was gone forever, sent on a funeral ship across the sea, buried in Midgard, amid trees and rocks. What Odin did not know is that Thok was none other than the trickster Loki in disguise, a god he knew as a friend. Worse still, it was Loki who led Balder to his death by a sprig of mistletoe. All these tricks and feints Loki had conceived. Some say it was in Loki's nature to be so cruel. Others argue it was revenge for deeds done by Odin to Loki and his children. There is a third view, that all these acts, 
unkind and cruel were sown long ago in the pattern of their lives. That we are not the authors of our own destiny, but only its readers. And that we... Oh. <laughs> uh, that we should fight against this view, for it is deeply unwelcome. Angua gara duha se ne at nowara raugara. Nene o niot ti wat ha det noya ke. Gorum brought this stone across the whale road for a strange purpose. I do not know why, but it seems to belong to this land. Yos, gods. Gua, ras no sage, wat neat da herde. Dagua weird it, go? Take it and guard it. It may be that one day you will know its purpose. Thank you. Each of you. For all you have done. Aya Watski. Yeti sot hugungaha. Ayeza ha herda da ratnardaga. Thanks for wrecking the boy, eh? No word from Gorham. Andia. Y'all, Rav Jordvik. You shirked your work for quite some time. Yora is no more. My name is Eivor, a dringer of the Raven Clan. And my purpose is fulfilled. Purpose? <laughs> what purpose? Gorm is dead! The troll is dead! Olaf! Sister, let us celebrate. Gorm Kutleson is no more. Slain by Eivor Ravenfriend. Eivor Forest Rider. Eivor Olavusaver. What is this? I had a long standing blood feud with Gorm and his clan. It is now laid to rest. Oh, the skulls will sing of this day. How Eivor traveled far and wide, hunting Gorm along the world's rim. Songs are not. Gorm is dead. Now I suggest you leave this place. There's no purpose for us here. I... I do not disagree. Gordon was a madman and a troll indeed. But he paid us in silver and that was enough. Brother, are you well? I feared the worst for you. I am well, yes. Oh, so well. And I may stay to linger one season or two with the friends I have made. As you wish, brother. And you, Eivor, where will you go? Across the sea with us, or back into the woods? A few tasks remain. I can linger a few days in...
I just want to go around and maybe see if there's like a, hunt, a legendary hunt or something in here. Other than that, if there's not, we'll just leave. I'm not going to do everything in here. We say, cutting the ocean skin, and when the dawn arrives, the time for hunt begins. They are making me wait quite a while. Time to end this chaos.
Eivor, you return to us. I do. Ready to lift. I will sail with you. Take care of yourself, Olaf. In this life and the next. Goodbye. Goodbye. Far winds the wheel round before me. Dark are the deeds that brought me here. Fate may bind my bones to this land, but for now I walk the sea. around me. Let's tell her the good news. Ready to set sail? I will be back. And I will be... No greater honor than to serve aboard your sea steed, Amor. To me, warrior. Let golden glory be our meat and meat. Huh? Gotham is dead, nameless and alone across the open sea. A master of the order hewn from the trunk of their dying tree. You are getting closer to the roots. I have to go. Then go in peace. for so long were you worried of course i was such a long voyage did you do what had to be done i did and i'm eager to focus on problems closer to home good it is done Gorham is dead the kyotvisan clan is wiped from this world good i would like to hear everything about your journey to vinland when you have time one day to see the Alliance map. Tell me about Jorvik. Hytham says there are three more targets there. If that is true, you are in luck. Our old friends Jor and Ljuvina have made their homes in Jorvik. Both had status and influence in Norway, so they may have valuable insights into the city's politics. That would make my work easier. What say you then? I will go now. Do you know where I might find Hjor and Lufina? When entering a new city, it is best to ask around the ports. The people there know more than the average peasant.
You and Petra chasing a white elk in the woods high as we speak. Impressive. Never seen anything like it. What have you got for me? Nothing else. I have something. We always have need for this. This will be a great help. Bringing me this would be helpful. Done for now. I will see you. Happy hunting! Eivor, darling, how nice to see you. Just came to give you a kiss. How sweet of you, love. Come here. May I see your stores? done? I must take my... Farewell, Eivor. Like 10, 10, 20 minutes left on this video. What I might do is just go around and grab some of these uh, these treasures that I haven't gotten, and then we'll, we'll hit the uh, the next area in the next video.
This place is heavily guarded. Yeah, <laughs> 
Survey the area. The statue has three large slits. 
Something may fit here. A knife or a dagger. Okay, so so if you got this just jogged my memory actually, I didn't even know where I was at. So if you guys are playing this game and you want to do everything, I believe you have to and you want to get that Thor's hammer and all that, this is where you have to be to kind of do all of that. I don't uh, remember exactly how to do it, but this is the area. So if you're it's in East Anglia, it's kind of on the east side of it, middle east, middle to the east side. But uh, it's right there if you do want to mark it, if you're interested in it. But that's where that's where I believe you have to kind of keep going back and forth. I believe I don't re exactly remember how to do it. I'll try to do it in, in this so you can see it. Um, plus Thor's hammer is like I think it's like the best weapon in the game and the armor is really good and stuff. So anyway. This statue has three lines. Maybe the next area I do, instead of going to, uh, oh god, I forget what is up here, what this is called. Jorvik, instead of going to Jorvik, but what we'll do, well, I can probably go up here and do that raid, actually. But, um, I probably should. Um, we'll go to that world, that kind of, like, where we fall asleep and go to the second half of that world. And, um, I think that's where you get... The, the armor pieces for Thor, I believe. And then you can come back here. So we'll just, you know, leave this as it is and we'll uh, we'll move forward. Oh, by the way, I got a new axe. I had some, uh, some currency. I bought some currency. Um, to level up my armor a little bit. Um, just to get this all leveled up. Because I, I don't have the golden thugman or whatever the fuck it's called to like get it all the way, all the way truly like up. But at least I leveled that up to where it was because I wasn't sure if I was struggling or not. I'm not having much of an issue at all, but um, I, I got this sword or this, this axe. It's pretty badass. It's got the frost build up on light attacks and um, it just, it's just cool looking. Um, and then we got uh, Baron's axe there, so on that side. So anyway, that's what I did. And I, I just think this armor fits him better as far as like what he is. And plus, it's a good change of pace. I try to try to change this up. You know what I mean? Change it up and uh, let's get this level up all the way. Let's get this level up all the way. Yeah, but buying like those like, like uh, and I think I'm leveling up awfully fast. I think it's because maybe I bought the boost pack. There's a boost pack. I probably bought it. I was super excited for this game when it came out. And I've done, I've poured some money into it, which is fine. I'm enjoying the experience. You know, if you can spend 200 bucks on, 200 hours on a game, you may as well, you know, take advantage if you, if you have a little extra money. But, um, so that's why I think I'm leveling up so fast. And, um, you know, I was... My armor was was pretty high. My my axe was pretty high level. I think that's why I'm kind of just smoking through the game. I'm you know I'm a decent player, but um, just I'm just I'm just really really smashing the shit out of this game to be honest. But uh, let's let's go uh, that way. Yeah, so it's just like a little bit OP, but you know what? In a game like this. To me, the challenge, the challenge in this game is the discovery and the exploration, not necessarily in the combat. I'm not big into playing a massive, massive, massive game. Uh, plus, I play a lot of games anyway. Um, so, for time purposes, I just kind of leveled up my shit pretty good so that I can, um, you know, not struggle as much and things like that. I've died a few times, but, yeah, you know, in my first playthrough, I didn't die a lot either. I didn't really die much either. Um... But, uh, so anyway, that's why I, I I don't play open world games on hard mode or anything like that, because 
unless it's the only game that I have. If it's a game where it's like, okay, this is the only game I have for a while, I'll throw in a hard mode um, for the challenge. But, uh, you know, I, I've, I've got four or five games I'm still waiting to, to play and show you guys and all that good stuff. So, so instead of playing a bunch of things at the same time, I want to get this done as, you know, as efficiently as possible. I'm definitely not in a rush. I just want to get done efficiently. You guys understand and appreciate it and uh let's just uh let's grab this last armor piece and then we'll probably end this uh this video yeah if you guys are watching hope you guys enjoy it uh, hit the like and subscribe turn on the bell for notifications and uh and if you want to put in the comments hey uh armor or something like that you suggest i don't know what the best armors and stuff in the game are i do know when when it came out the thor stuff was like the stuff to get but uh i don't necessarily need to be overly op but i just want to get all the the, the, the good stuff and cool stuff and this berserker stuff i believe came with the pre-order and i never used it so uh, i figured what the fuck i'll use it <laughs> you know i'll use it i bought that other uh, fire and ice set i think it's cool but i do want to change things up a little bit i think you know run around for Hours and hours and hours of the same shit will just get boring. Plus, there's something cool about your character, you know, being so close to his father and using his father's, you know, weapon and stuff like that. I think that's pretty cool. I think what we're going to do on the next episode or two or three or whatever it takes, I think what we'll do is go through all the areas and do this. I want to open up the blues just to see what they are. I want to do the legendary hunts and fights and stuff. I don't really want to do the world events. I don't really care about that. I don't need to do it. And uh, we're definitely going to get all the wealth, all the uh, you know, the golden items and all that. So I think we'll do that. We'll go clean up the, the world and then we'll we'll come back and we'll we'll start. Um, go, we'll go to another area, whether it's Jorik or the um, the fantastic fantastical other area whatever it is I think I was just here shit yes I need to go here that's what happens you don't clean out your map you mark things on your map, you don't clean them out. You do dumb shit.
Your feet, the dogs. Oh. 